Moses was keeping watch over the flock of his father-in-law Jethro, who was the priest of Midian. And Moses led the flock out beyond the wilderness to the place called Horeb, the mountain of God. And there the angel of the Lord appeared to Moses in the flames out of a burning bush. And Moses looked and he saw that though the bush was burning, it was not being consumed. And so he said to himself, I must turn aside and see this great sight to see why the bush is not being burned up. And when God saw that Moses had turned aside, the angel of the Lord spoke to Moses and said, Moses, Moses. Moses said, here I am. And God said, come no closer and remove the sandals from your feet for the place on which you are standing is holy ground. I am the God of your father, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob. And then Moses, Moses hid his face because he was afraid to look at God. And then the Lord said to Moses, I have seen the misery of my people who are in Egypt. I have heard their cries on account of their taskmasters. I know their sufferings. And I have come down to deliver them from the Egyptians and bring them out of that land and into a good and broad land, a land flowing with milk and honey to the country of the Canaanites and the Hittites, the Amorites and the Perizzites, the Hivites and the Jebusites. The cries of the Israelites have now come to me and I have seen the Egyptians oppressing them. So I have come to send you to go to Pharaoh to bring the Israelites out from the land of Egypt. But Moses said, well, who am I to go before Pharaoh and, and bring the, Egypt, the Israelites out of Egypt? And God said, I'll go with you and this will be a sign for you. When you bring the Israelites out of Egypt, you will worship me on this mountain. And then Moses said, if, if I go to the Israelites and say, the God of your ancestors has sent me to you, and they say, what is this God's name? Well, what do I tell them? And God said to Moses, I am who I am. Thus you shall say to them, I am has sent me to you. And then God also said to Moses, thus you shall say to the Israelites, the Lord, the God of your ancestors, the God of Abraham, the God of Jacob and Isaac has sent me to you. This is my name forever. 
And this is my title for all generations. Through these words, may we hear the word of God for us in these days.